I know what you're thinking. Why would you use an Air 2S when the Mavic 3 exists? The truth is, I find the Air 2S active track sufficient when tracking people and vehicles, so I just wanted to see what would happen when tracking airplanes at a nearby airport. The results are actually pretty interesting. The Air 2S can clearly track the planes, but it won't give you the outline like the tracking for people or cars. Faced with this issue, I went to the DEI subreddit when I was told that it wasn't actually supposed to work on airplanes, that I was going to end up on a watch list for using my drone on a stick, and that I should put my drone in the air right next to a major international airport. I will say that the hyperlapse of a cloud as it moves across the sky is nice. If you'd like to see the same hyperlapse at night or from a different angle, get subscribed and I might retry this from the other side with a plane's start to take off.